Hollywood gets rocked by a brand new nanny gate. And this time, it is Gwen Stefani's ex who was accused of having an affair right in their own home. Here's the thing, Nancy. People have been wondering what made Gwen file for divorce. Well, maybe now we know. The allegations against Gavin Rossdale are explosive. Yeah, and our top story tonight, it's all about the new report. Sex lies and another nanny. Wow. Sources tell us Gavin Rossdale was having an affair with the nanny for at least three years. It's unbelievable what's been going on in that house. I think the worst part is also that it was in your home. Gwen found out about the affair when a very suggestive and racy texts and nude photos of the nanny started appearing on one of her kids' iPads. It turns out one of the iPads was connected to Gavin's cell phone. Us Weekly claims Gavin denied an affair at first, but when he allegedly confessed, she decided to end their marriage. They had an affair even while Gwen was pregnant with her last child, Apollo. A friend of Gwen's tells ET the events in the story are true. Meanwhile, there's new video of Gwen out today, leaving her home in a Range Rover after the story broke this morning. And this must be tough. Us Weekly, out Friday, points out this image of Gavin hiking with a nanny in 2012, his hand on her lower back. This is when the suspicions really started being aroused within Gwen. So who is the nanny at the center of the story? Her name is Mindy Mann, and she has a lot of people comparing her looks to Gwen's. The tinted hair, rocker style, and sunny demeanor. She worked for Gavin and Gwen since 2008. Gavin's rep could not be reached for comment about the cheating claims, but a source close to the singer tells ET that he just wants Gwen to be happy. And if she's happy with Blake, well, then so be it. All this drama is unfolding amidst the voices' live playoffs. It's so much emotion. And it's shifting attention from the contestants to the coaches. If there's anybody on this planet that can handle rumors and gossip and jabs, you're talking to him right now. ET was backstage at The Voice last night, and we have to give Adam credit. He took the heat off Gwen by playing up his bromance with Blake. Adam, we've got to talk about this new dynamic on the show. Blake's got a new favorite coach. Well, you know, no, he doesn't. No? <laughs> you are. Who, how do you guys share custody oh my God. of him now? Um, That's what we all want to well, know. First of all, he's always been mine. He always will be mine. He's nobody else's. Now I got to put you on the spot a little bit. The last time I saw you, Carson, you told me to my face I trusted you. Yep. And you, I asked about Blake and Gwen, and you said, Blake, you wish. Right. <laughs> what do you make of these Blake and Gwen rumors? I think they're hilarious. <laughs> I told Blake, I said, you wish, buddy. Listen, that's a family matter, and uh, we're not going to discuss that tonight. But no. Yeah, no. I get Carson protecting his of friend. Of course. Yeah, all right. Many people believe that Gwen's new song, Used to Love You, is about Gavin, and it was just announced that she will perform it at the American Music Awards, airing November the 22nd on ABC.